I am Marko Milivojević, I am Serbian uh, CBRM National Focal Point and Deputy Head of the, of the CBRM COE Regional Secretariat in Tbilisi, Georgia for nine countries. Every man uh, who, who is working for some state body like me, for for example, I'm police officer. Mm -hmm. uh, it's always um, important day job for me, police job. This is important for me. But uh, in some cases, like in outbreaks or natural disasters or uh, terrorist attack uh, cases, we need uh, good cooperation between state bodies and not only inside the country we need a network between us on the regional and international level too so <clears throat> we need a good cooperation between doctors and policemen on the site because uh, maybe we will have same problem but with different approach. One approach will be medical approach, one approach will be police approach. Mm. For example, uh, at the moment refugees, uh, we have a lot of refugees here and in the past, and we need cooperation and collaboration between medical uh, staff and police staff because, uh, you know, uh, Police, uh, policemen don't have in the school uh, some type of education like this. They have some basic education, but uh, doctors are here to, mm. to do something more, you know. But sometimes uh, uh, medical uh, uh, staff need uh, some kind of support of police and or something. This is not only between police and, and medical uh, staff. Uh, we must have some kind of network between a lot of people because this is sometimes in connection with chemical, with uh, radiological, nuclear, etc. etc. It can be a mixture of different dangerous things and di di uh, dangerous, different uh, dangerous threats. According to, to the Serbian example, we have a law of uh, emergency situation. Uh, according to that uh, law, the police are the boss in some urgent situation. Mm -hmm. In some different countries, maybe public health uh, body is the main body for something, but in our case, we are uh, police uh, officers. Are the Boss and uh, the Minister of Interior are the main guy of the of the some uh, main body <clears throat> in the country, together with uh, representative from uh, public health, from Ministry of Health, from Ministry of Defense, etc. Mm -hmm. So, uh, in, in that case, we need cooperation. We need very very close cooperation mm -hmm. and. Uh, about the training, trainings. We need trainings, but not only for one kind of people. We need the trainings with mixture of people, because in the trainings you can use this opportunity for the training to meet people, each other, to exchange experience, uh, different approach, of, of the Chinese and uh, this is a time for exchange of personal uh, data between Chinese trainees because on the site, on the spot, on the real spot, this is not a time for exchange business cards. So Serbia is uh, one of uh, the first countries who uh, built it up national CBRN team, mm. exactly the first one, to be honest. Uh, and we had a representative from uh, Ministry of Health.
and for us uh, that representative is the Ministry of Health. If we have some question, we will ask uh, that representative and this is our contact with uh, that ministry. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, in our case, we, uh, when we try to, to uh, write uh, CBRA National Action Plan, everything was perfect according to the radiological and nuclear, according to the chemical. We had a lot of experts in that case. But when we touch B part, bio part, biological part, but bio don't mean, you know, bio means everything, especially in connection with, with the medicine. Mm -hmm. When we touch this part, we know nothing about that. So we had one representative from the Ministry of, it, of uh, Health. We asked it about, do you know anything about biosafety, biosecurity, epi, uh, virology or something else? And I said, no, uh, you know, I'm a lawyer. Uh, uh, yes, I'm working for the Ministry of Health, but I know who know something about that. And after that, uh, we had a meeting with 20 different people from the, let's say, health organizations. Why with 20? Because they are responsible, you know, I'm a policeman, I know nothing about medicine. We are responsible for public health. We are first responders. Okay, we are virologists, we are ep epidemiologists, I don't know how many different issues uh, they cover and after that we try to catch the system <laughs> of the health, it's, it was very difficult <laughs> in that time, but uh, on, the, on the end we had uh, more than 50 different experts who are working on CBRA National Action Plan. more than 50, uh, more than 20 was from medicine part, let's say. So uh, the B part was very important and missing part in, in that way. And uh, in that period, it was two years ago, I recognized Batut Institute as the main part for cooperation and coordination but the Institute uh, in Serbia is uh, Institute for Public Health. We have on the Balkan route uh, a lot of rep refugees as, uh, mm -hmm. uh, through Macedonia, Greece, Macedonia and Serbia. And we need uh, some kind, real uh, kind of cooperation between medical sector and uh, police, for example, especially border police. And forensic police because forensics are there for the identification of the persons who are crossing to the border and uh, we need cooperation because of possible outbreaks or something like that. This is a, a very big number of people, hmm. maybe between uh, five and ten thousand per day. So this is some kind of mass event every day. So we need that kind of cooperation. And in the future, you have to think about mixture of Chinese on the side, because this is situation is real. Uh, mixture of, of Chinese in, in that way and uh, it can be trainings not only for medical people, but for, from other state bodies too.